welcome to our World Metals, uh, your one-stop channel for all things RC and sometimes quilting and sewing. Uh, today's RC day and we're going to be talking about um, servo testers. Uh, if, for most of you that have flown, you probably are familiar with this little handy dandy blue product uh, commonly used for uh, testing servos. Not bad, I found that it didn't work with all products though. And what I did find is I found this uh, called this HJ uh, servo uh, tester that I found at uh, AliExpress uh, I'll, and I'll have a link to this. Uh, I don't review products all the time but these I had a couple of products that I really was impressed with um, and I'm also impressed with the price. Uh, I'm disappointed when you buy something and it, even if you wait six weeks it doesn't work. Uh, it's not worth sending it back because it was probably just this was only three dollars. The great thing about this uh, servo tester is that it has a digital readout. Uh, the comparison between the two, and they're basically the same price, is, uh, there's no comparison between the two. Uh, and this seems to work with all servos. I had a problem with this is that for some servos it just didn't work. I don't know why. Uh, I'm not that uh, knowledgeable around the exact electronics of how these work, but they don't work on all servos. I've tested this device with, uh, that's my balance charger back there, just telling me that I balanced one of my batteries. There we go, that's turned off. Um, it, uh, it works with, uh, with, with all, all batteries, the, all the servos that I have, digital and analog, uh, with no problems, with a nice display readout. It also, you can also find your midpoints by using the digital display, so you can do an appropriate adjustment before you install the servo in your uh, in your model, and also you can find what's the full range, the calibration range uh, uh, that the servo will work at. Excellent product to have. Um, you need to have a battery, uh, a six volt input. Um, I just use a little battery pack and, and plug it in uh, with a switch. Uh, and I'll send a link to this. Highly recommend if you're looking at doing any servo testing, and if you're in the hobby, you probably are going to do some servo testing. I'll send a link to this product. Again, if the vendor doesn't have it, do a search for the product. One of the under vendors will have it, probably for the same price or even sometimes even cheaper. Hope you enjoyed this short video. Uh, if you liked, please press like and subscribe and uh, we'll see you next time at Emerald Meadows.